即係你做一個 project 出嚟，你寫唔到出嚟嘅話咧，你寫唔到佢嘅 success and failure factors 咧，就即係吹水。So I will back up this project by an academic paper, whether it is a success case or a failure case. But this case is success. So I will measure what is the success factors. Even if it is a failure social enterprise, you have to find out why it failed. So this is the academic part that has to do to, to chip in. And also the NGO is I work with different NGO to find the, the deprived woman. 咁嗰啲 deprived woman 喺邊度揾出嚟啦？大家估唔估到啊 ？Where do I find the deprived woman? On the street. Are you are deprived, so you come to work for me. Or 啊、uh, ，所以 that's why 咧 ，we we need to know a little bit about like the, what what she said is that know more about the society 喺天水圍喺深水埗有冇多 deprived woman？ 咁我呢個 project 或 this project 咧 ，I work with some some people that you know. I work with 馮檢基。逢檢幾喺深水埗有好多 deprived 嘅女人，我喺工聯會、勞聯，嗰度有啲最 deprived、最最貧窮嘅 ，the poor、the poorest of the poor， 我就揾嗰啲 deprived woman 出嚟做做呢啲 job。And then you know postnatal nursing care is not 龍頭嘅 law。You know the market price, the market price for the private one， they are paying twenty thousand to thirty thousand， 兩萬至三萬蚊一個月嘅陪月月，你買隨之期嗰個幾千個月。好勁嘅培育嗰人工可以 ，but the NGO pay them a few thousand，NGO 就俾幾千蚊佢哋，叫叫佢做培育員。如果私家嘅培育員係兩三萬一個月嘅，咁 Raymond 嗰啲培育員幾多錢啊？一萬蚊一個月，個個話話正啊 ，ten thousand dollars a month。There's no NGO who can who can who can beat my price。我係一萬蚊一個月，所以嘅 price。Why？ 不過係 generous because。I think that this is the price or the salary that they deserve to take. First thing, second thing is that they have already contributed certain amount of their time and energy to take care of the baby, and I think they should get reasonable return. Third, I do not have any administration costs or not do not. I have minimum administration costs for my HKSEIC, so I am able to to pay them ten thousand dollars per month. And then for for the deprived women, I also organize uh, because I'm a Christian. Okay, I also organize fellowship for them because if you are if you are designing a social enterprise, you just you are not just doing a business. Oh, this is a lucrative business. They can earn ten thousand dollars a month. Fun, fun for them, good for them. But how about their mindset? How to make them stand up? 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 How to make So I so I start fellowship with them. I start fellowship. I I the to make them become Christian is not my major role. My major role is that to let them know more exposures. They were how to communicate with others, open minded, and then to know more about each other. So yeah, this is a mindset change process. So when you start as so when you are thinking of designing a social enterprise, you just oh this is a lucrative business. This is a profitable business. Then done deal no. You have also to take care of the social mission part. What is the social mission part? How do you take care of those people? You got other people. Those young sons, young ladies, those young men, young women, young girls, 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 哦，原來唔係你，原來我俾四千蚊人工佢做 part time 嘅，佢阿爸阿媽俾佢零用錢係五千蚊，佢翻嚟發鬼咪梗唔翻啦。咁 but life is not like this. You have to get a job. So all those things you have to take into account when you are designing your business plan, your social mission for your potential innovative social enterprise, and how to make use of the social capital to make it sustainable, and what kind of connections do you have when you are thinking of starting a so starting a social enterprise. So I encourage you all. Okay, for 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 university students, as you said, I have no connections. I only know my teachers, my professors, my lecturers, and my classmates. So put some time to do voluntary job for the society. When you are engaging in voluntary jobs, then you you have the opportunity to learn many different kinds of people. Then your social capital, your networking, is building up from that area. Why I know so many people because I spend. Many much I spend fifty percent of my time in community service, so I know lots of people. And from the networking, then then you can pull in different resources 
to enable you to start different social enterprises. So networking is very important. Because you are still young, so I encourage you to participate in more inter-university inter functions, voluntary work. Really, this is good for your future career and also good for your future life. Okay, for the government part is the hospital authority. So I said four sectors collaboration because I have the I have worked together with hospital authority to provide the postnatal nursing care, social enterprise projects for the government hospital for the for the mothers who are going to deliver a baby. Uh, any question on this case? Oh, good, good question. Ah, good question. This is, this is practical. Any idea? Good question. How to make sure that they are capable and able to handle the job properly? Because when I told the potential mother, I have this group of deprived women. I, I don't use the deprived. I have this group of women, and it's all oh, they are poor, so they are dirty, so they don't know how to take care of my baby. My baby is my, uh, is all, is all my life. So you, so you entrust a poor and dirty woman to take care of my baby because they are deprived. So how to sell this? How to make sure, like what he said, how to make sure has the quality. Her training, yes, yes, training, training. Can you elaborate a little bit more? Okay. It's on the right direction. Actually, before I criticize the government, because I know this is video, video tape and re recording, before I criticize the government, I said something good about the government first. Actually, the government has inject lots of resources in the training of the deprived sector. For the young people, we have the and for the older generation, we have the ERB, Employees Retraining Board, who you join with Fun Gong. How many of you have heard about ERB before? Okay. Why ERB is so rich? Can somebody answer me? ERB is very rich. Can you share? What ERB is doing? Can you share? More or less, ERB because they got the four hundred dollars from the Philippine uh, Philippine workers. More young soy lo bin eh, you say five man eh, just buy it off ERB. Who you join to find gold? So they have a lot of money. They got a they got a great amount of money, and then they provide different training courses through the NGO to the deprived sector. So going back to my to, to the question is that my postnatal nursing carers they. The minimum requirement is they have to pass the certificate to get a certificate from ERB that they are how to say they got the basic training for postnatal nursing care. But the next point I want to criticize the government is that the government only provides training courses. They never think of placement. So for most of the NGOs, they get money from the government and do various types of training. But after the training, the people still going to nowhere. The young people, the deprived women, the elderly, the whatever, they go to nowhere because there is no placement for them. So another good part for your business plan writing is that you have to do the placement. This is also our chief executive main concern is to provide employment opportunities for the deprived or for the people in Hong Kong. So, bourgeoisie,就係我哋特首講嘅。咁但係而家嘅政府嘅做法就好多就係做咗training,training啊，青年啊，咩展示啊嗰啲咁樣。Placement is a very difficult, a difficult task because you need to have the connections, you need to find the right company to get the people being employed by them.